With a history of community-mindedness for its longtime support of local events and fundraisers, the Mansfield News Journal had to make the right choice when hiring. Enter a young reporter, a newlywed, a local boy from the Shelby Settlement, a 1968 graduate of Buckeye Central High School, Tom Brennan. Tom attended Ohio State Mansfield for two years and finished at Ohio State main campus with a degree in journalism. Tom notes, living on the big campus with all the diversity, it opened my eyes and changed my life. He worked as an intern for a community newspaper to get his sea legs in journalism. Shortly after his marriage to Joyce, a surgical nurse, Tom was recruited away from the Lyman News in 1972. He began his notable career here with the News Journal, a career that spanned over 43 years. He cares about covering the community and uncovering the truth, noted a longtime co-worker. As the general assignment reporter with the News Journal, Tom quickly became the go-to person and covered every beat. From reporter, he moved to the Sunday editor spot. The job of a reporter is not a Monday through Friday nine to five job, he remarked about putting together the Sunday edition. It took all week and at that time the papers were huge. I put out the news section for the Sunday paper. Promotions took him from the Sunday editor to the city editor, a job he really loved. His skill in asking the right questions and excellent reporting was noticed, and after a short five-year period, he moved up to a supervisory position. A quick study, Tom learned the production side of the newspaper business, which would prove invaluable later in his career. While not a smooth ride from the 1970s when Tom joined the paper, until his retirement, he lived through changes in ownership, management, publishers, reduction in staff, relocating of the printing operation, and the internet. Over these tumultuous years, Tom Brennan was unflappable. He said his greatest achievement was survival. Clearly, surviving through the uncharted waters of change within a community was a skill Tom possessed. As the community evolved, both in landscape and economic climate, Tom coached his team to actively seek the truth and report it. Whether covering a political campaign, a hostage situation, or a feel-good story from the community, Tom encouraged honest and straightforward reporting. Over the 43 years of his tenure with the News Journal, Tom was invested in many community events. He is most proud of Make a Difference Food Drive, United Way Dash to the Goal, North Central Ohio Soapbox Derby, Brighten the Christmas, Capital Campaigns, and the News Journal All-Star Basketball Classic, an event through which the Rehab Center has benefited for over 37 years. Tom's involvement and an influence with many other community leaders helped to keep the 179th unit here at LOM. A little known fact, he even danced tuxedo and all in the prominent men's tap line to benefit the Renaissance Theater. Tom was on the job about 20 years when the first Rehab Telethon aired. Today we celebrate the 25th Rehab Telethon, 1992-2016. From the first and for all subsequent Rehab Telethons, the Mansfield News Journal was a major supporter of this event with advertising or an article about the rehab program. Additionally, for many years, Tom volunteered his time as an on-air host or a community guest. Retired now, Tom and wife Joyce share a strong commitment to their family, having raised four children and now watching four grandchildren grow up. You can't take the commitment to making the community a better place to live out of a leader. When asked about his future, Tom replied, oh, I'll be around helping where I can. This is why this very special 25th Rehab Telethon tribute is for our friend Tom Brennan. <laughs>